hybrid solutions for the security in the Black Sea region conference has kicked off in Odessa. During a two-day event, defense and security experts will discuss the main security threats in the Black Sea area and the ways to address them. The event was organized by NATO, Harvard University's Kennedy School of Government, German Marshall Fund and Charity Fund Predonavia and brought together more than 60 experts in the defense and security area. We talk not about hybrid war or hybrid warfare. We're talking about hybrid solutions. This is a time we need to think about out of the box and bring some solutions and see which solutions could be viable and implemented, which should be discussed later. The opening panel consisted of the director of Harvard Black Sea Security Program, chairman of Odessa Regional Council, ambassadors of the U.S. and Turkey. In the beginning of the conference, Dr. Lada Roslitsky, director for strategic communications of Ukraine Today, read a letter from NATO representative and called on the participants to commemorate the victims of the Brussels attacks with a moment of silence. During his opening remarks, U.S. ambassador to Ukraine mentioned two types of security threats to Ukraine, external and internal one. What happens here in Ukraine will play a critical role in securing what has been the goal of American foreign policy for a quarter century now, that is a Europe whole, free, and at peace. But equally important is how Ukraine's leaders and its people react to this challenge. I'm not talking about the use of force, but rather the implementation of deep and lasting reform. The conference will last for two days, and its organizers hope it will bring Ukraine and the entire Black Sea region one step closer to peace and security. This is Volodymyr Solub and Andriy Postavets reporting from Odessa for Ukraine Today.